The accommodation on campus is actually really nice. All the rooms are quite spacious. You can have an ensuite bedroom or not an ensuite bedroom. There's self-catering, there's non-self-catering. If you don't go for self-catered, then you get fed by the uni. I was self-catered with an ensuite bathroom and absolutely loved it. This is a Vic Hughes bedroom. You get a single bed, um, wardrobe space, a tea making facility. You get your own ensuite bathroom with a shower. Um, there's also places to pin things up. There's storage for your books and there's a desk working space so you can do your work from your own room. This is Vic Hughes's common room, one of the floors. We've got plenty of social areas to sit so you can have friends over before you go on a night out. There's also a kitchen as this is a self-catered block so you're able to cook together or individually, whatever you want to do. So there's lots of freedom. So the building behind me is Woodlands. It's one of our catered blocks. You go and eat in the dining hall if you live there. But it's also got kitchenettes and ensuite bathrooms in all the rooms. Whilst the building to the side of us is West Lodge. It's one of our self-catered blocks with kitchens and common areas in. But it also has amazing underfloor heating ran from the biomass heat on campus. Behind us we have West Lodge, but we are currently at Code Court, which is one of our catered blocks. It has ensuite bathrooms as well as shared bathrooms and has some amazing views to look at. This is Bled, it has shared bathrooms, but is also one of our catered blocks with kitchenettes. It's quite a social block. We also have accommodation in our main building. We have George Wing, which has shared bathrooms, and we have main build, which has 33 bedrooms, twin or single, with en suites. Both these blocks are catered. Mm -hmm.